Thank you for joining us on HXGN TV. My name is Brian. Civil FEM lowers the barriers to nonlinear FEA for structural and civil engineering by combining a very advanced nonlinear solver with a friendly, easy to use graphic interface for a variety of important problems with single and multiple nonlinearities. Joining me today is Jose Miguel Moreno and Roman Martin from Ingecyber to discuss structural safety assessment during construction and service life of infrastructures with FE nonlinear analysis and civil FEM powered by Mark. Thanks for joining me, gentlemen. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Thank you for this opportunity. Absolutely, it's good to have you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Jose, let's start with you. Tell us a little bit about the Ingecyber company. Okay, Ingecyber is a computer aided engineering company. Uh, with more than 30 years of experience. Mm -hmm. We specialize in development and distribution of computer-aided engineering softwares. Cur uh, currently, we have a, an OEM agreement with MSC Softwares, mm -hmm. which now is part of, of Hexagon Groups. To, to World World Market, uh, for Civil Defense Power by Mark, as an advanced uh, CHI solution. Excellent. So tell us about the CAA software, Civil FEM powered by Mark, what is it? Yes, Civil FEM is a computer aided engineering software that combines the power of a nonlinear uh, Mark solver analysis solver, mm -hmm. uh, and a user friendly interface, and specific tools for civil engineering. Like, for example, post processing load combinations and check and design accordance to the, uh, to the standard codes, mm -hmm. etc. Uh, we like to say that the film powered by Mars lowers the barriers to nonlinear uh, analysis mm -hmm. to the civil structural uh, engineering fields. Why did you decide to develop it? Yeah, that's a good question. We, we saw a great need for nonlinear analysis mm -hmm. in both the construction and civil engineering. Uh, therefore, we incorporate uh, these nonlinearities non for structural and civil engineering fields. Uh, for example, no linear, no, no, no linear material models, mm -hmm. large displacements, uh, advanced contacts, etc. Excellent. Well, thank <laughs> you. Well, Roman, what other significant features does Civil FEM offer in addition well, to what Jose said? The main great uh, significant feature we have mm -hmm. is that, uh, that Civil FEM combines geotechnical mm -hmm. and structural analysis in, one ge in just one model, so we can analyze geotechnical results, mm -hmm. uh, such as stresses on soil, uh, settlements, uh, possible failures, safety factors, and also we can design the structural part mm -hmm. by the most important in the international codes for concrete, steel, and also reinforce, uh, reinforcing and, and pre-stress concrete. Uh, in example, we can, we can model the a construction, a tunnel construction, and also design the cover, the, the concrete cover of the tunnel, but also analyze if there's a building over the, over the, over the tunnel or on the soil. We can analyze if the, the tunnel construction affected, uh, it could be any, any displacement, any settlement, mm -hmm. and also any cracks in the structure over the, the crack limits and, or any uh, type of damage. So why is why is this analysis? Why is nonlinear analysis even needed in the civil and structural engineering? Well, actually, nature is not linear, especially for ultimate loads where mm -hmm. we need to ensure safety. Uh, well, uh, it's not linear. In example, material stress stress relationship is not linear. A concrete has different beha behavior for tension and compression. Cables only works on tension. Well, uh, nature is not linear. So to understand the real behavior of the structures, we need to uh, perform a detailed nonlinear analysis. Otherwise, uh, to ensure safety, we have to oversize the structure and increase the cost. Okay. Yeah. Tell us about the non-linear behavior of concrete. Well, that is a really important point of civil fame, a very powerful point, because civil fame is able to, to model in detail the concrete behavior, the different type of concrete, uh, like uh, reinforced concrete, fiber reinforced concrete, steel reinforced, also post tension concrete. And well, basically, concrete behavior is for tension. There's a, a crack stress, over that is crack stress, depends on the concrete type. We ca can have a brittle failure, also, we can have a softening if we have a uh, fiber reinforced. Or this, even if we have a big amount of fiber reinforced, we, ca we could have hardening and after that softening and failure. And for compression, the, the stress-strain relationship is a parabolic uh, behavior, but also depends on concrete type, uh, we could have hardening or brittle failure with crushing. 
see the frame is able to model all these type of concretes in detail and has really accuracy results. Okay. Is it possible to analyze soils mechanics and geotechnics projects? Yes, that's a good question. Civil Femme can model uh, soil in detail because we have a big amount of nonlinear geotechnical material models such as Mark Coulomb, Cam Clay, Cam Clay uh, Hook and Brown, and also we consider water table, uh, poor, poor water pressure, and all its effects, and we can analyze in detail the geotechnics for, uh, for many types of projects such as uh, well, foundations, tunneling, mining, so it's a, that's a strong point for from civil film. Okay. Can it simulate slippage and lifting and joints? Yes. Civil film also has uh, an advanced contact uh, contact elements and contact behavior. Uh, just many type types of contacts. An example: uh, glue and breaking glue over a stress limit. Mm -hmm. Also, also uh, slippage with friction or cohesion frictional contacts. And not only for for to analyze. Um, the contact between foundation and, and soil or different contacts between different parts of the structure. Uh, those contacts can also be used to model uh, faults in the terrain or also cracks in, on rocks. So we have important contacts uh, in our software. Okay. What about nonlinear stage and construction processes? Well, that's also an important and a strong point in civil film because, well, uh, we can not only deactivate and activate different parts of the model to, simul to simulate the construction and, and excavation process, but also uh, civil film uh, material, material models, material properties are time-dependent properties. So uh, on every stage, we activate the model, uh, we activate the, the material properties. In example, concrete, concrete stiffness in the first days uh, is increased very hard, so civil film uh, uh, activates and deactivates different parts of the model, modify material properties, so we can perform a really detailed construction and stage process. Excellent. Yeah. All right. Jose, yeah. what other advanced analysis does Civil FEM have in comparison to other CAA models? Yes. Well, uh, I could like to say about that, that question. Sure, you yeah. want to jump into that? Yeah, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> sorry. Yeah, yeah but because that's, that's a technical question and mm. I would like okay. to, to answer. Absolutely. Yes, Civil uh, FEM is, is, has our, I would like to highlight about that. Uh, that uh, civil firm uh, can perform uh, multi-physic analysis. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. One of them is uh, ther thermal structural analysis. And an example, uh, well, civil firm can perform first thermal mm -hmm. analysis and use uh, the temperatures and the thermal results mm -hmm. in the structural part because uh, civil firm materials are also thermal uh, dependent. Mm -hmm. So in example, we can, we can perform uh, we can model a fire on a steel structure, and we can calculate uh, the time before collapse of the structure to ensure safety, to evacuate the, the building, and just calculate uh, just time before uh, the fire melt the structure and collapse. Okay. Other, other multiphysic analysis is CPH mm -hmm. structural analysis, uh, well, where we can calculate different water table uh, levels, also consider different mm -hmm. the variation of poor water pressure mm -hmm. and its effect effects on the on the soil and the, and the terrains. And in example, analyze a heavy rain on a slope and how can it fail because of the reduction of the stiffness. Wow. Yeah. Also a dam with different water table variations and it affects on the pressure and the on the soil around and any possible failures. Yeah. So multiphysic analysis is al also mm. a powerful point on civil sure. film. Excellent. What are your okay. thoughts on, on all that as well? Okay, no, no, we say industries, okay. Civil film popular mark is more directly focused on related construction industry. Okay. Like transportation, indu uh, infrastructure, soil mechanics, mine, mining, as well, as well as power generation, oil and gas, and other that require se seismic and advanced nonlinear analysis. Okay. What other hexagon business lines is this going to complement? Yes, Silfen gives a clear added value and is a complementary technology to most of the business li li uh, lines, like PPN, mining, geosystems, and of course, HMI for infrastructures. Mm, excellent. Actually, th uh, we are in search of improving the connection between Silfen and Hexagon, and Hexagon technology. Use, uh, for example, using Hexagon se sensoring and monitoring tools during, during the construction process and the lifetime of infrastructures. In this way, why we will close the gap between reality and simulation. I think this, is, this will be exciting. It is, very exciting. Yeah. Excellent, thank you gentlemen. We'll well, say. Thank, thank you very much for this change really yeah, yeah, this. to explain <laughs> about, about us. For more yeah. information on IngestCyber and Civil FEM, please visit ingestcyber.com and civilfem.com. Also, for more HXGN TV, watch additional episodes. Tune in, hxgnspotlight.com. Thanks so much for watching.